In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how you can easily migrate your Shopify website to a WooCommerce website. So if you want to switch to WordPress with WooCommerce from Shopify, then I'm going to show you how you can import basically anything, how you can convert your complete website. So if you already have hosting, that's good. If you don't, I'll put a link in the description to SiteGround. That's the hosting that I recommend. Um, so what you want to do then, make sure you're logged in to your Shopify account and also on WordPress. Uh, what you want to do, you want to go to the link in the description here as well. Uh, that brings you to cart2cart.com. Uh, and this is a card migration for your website. So what we have to do here, we have to select the source card setup, which will be Shopify. So type it in, show all, just like that. Now we have to type in Shopify and there it is. Um, now we have to paste in our URL. So we have to do that right here. Um, paste it in and now we have to find, find the API password. And for that we have to go back to Shopify right here and then go to apps. So from apps you want to go ahead and hit manage private apps. And I've already set up the private apps but you have to enable this that we can create a private app then hit create new private app and there we go now it's going to load so this may take a couple of moments as you can see but there we go now we have to name private app we can do cart to cart and then the emergency developer email will be info at cart to cart dot com and now we have to go ahead and scroll down and give access to any everything. So give access to everything, read and write, read access, basically do that for everything right here. So cart to cart actually knows um, how to mig what we have to migrate, you know? So once you've done all of that, you can hit save and then this one will be saved. So now as you can see, here I have it. I have saved it right here. And here you have the API key and the contact email. So you can go ahead and click on this just like that. And now we can go ahead and go down to you see API key and password. We can hit show and copy this API key, go back to cart to cart and paste it in here. So now we set up the source card and now we have to set up the target cards. So the target card will be WooCommerce because that's the plugin that we use for WordPress, of course. And now it's going to set this up. We have to copy our domain from our website admin login and admin password. I'm going to fill this in right now as well. There we go. And now we have to select choose entities and it's going to connect. After this is done, it will bring you to this page where we can select the entities we want to migrate. So you can just select all. I'm going to do that. Now you can hit start demo migration. From there, it's going to go into the demo migrator where we can uh, migrate basically anything from our Shopify store to our new WooCommerce store. Then once the demo migration is done, you can see that everything is working. And now we can select all the options for the real migration. As you can see for me, this will be around $240, which is quite expensive. But to transfer all these entities, it's not going to be cheaper anywhere else. So it's probably a lot cheaper for you because this is a very, uh, I put a lot of stuff on this website. But you can just Pay this, start the full migration, and then the migration is going to start. You can put everything on your WooCommerce website with WordPress. If this helped you out, please leave a like, please subscribe, and see you next time. Have a good day.